Race developing in the NBC Central and Aquinas, both chasing on Alaska now as we begin the second half of the conference season. Blue Golds and Riverhawks locking up at Central tonight. News 19's Colton Emsweiler was there. Hello, Colton. Scott Central coming off a loss Tuesday night. They haven't lost back to back conference games since 2015. Central won the first meeting between these two back in December. Home team down after halftime because the Blue Golds could do no wrong. A sky hook for Tanner Peterson. Aquinas would build a double digit lead in the second. Peterson again, this time for three. It's 45 to 35. Riverhawks in need of a miracle and his name is Henry Meyer. A neat little shot there. He had 11 straight points for Central and momentum is going their way. Mostly because Shane Willenbring had too much of it here. An offensive foul. Gives the home team the ball back, and they tie things up. Meyer pulls up from the paint. It's good, 49 apiece. Next basket, heavy contact, no whistle, and Meyer gives Central the lead. Are you kidding me? 15 seconds to go now. Logan Becker with speed, scoops and scores. We're tied at 60 as Central takes their final timeout. With six seconds left, Meyer inbounds. They give it right back to him, and he just goes through everyone, and it's good! Henry Meyer beats the buzzer. Game over as the celebration begins. Riverhawks win 62 to 60. Put this one on the short list for game of the year. Now here's the hero to talk about that final play. Man, you know, we Coach Fergit, uh, he drew up a great little play just to give and go action, you know. And when, when I saw the play, I saw they weren't going to come and guard me. I said, give me the ball, I'm getting a bucket. And, you know, I just shout out all my, all my teammates, man. We executed all night and, you know, we won the toughness battle. I'm just, I'm just glad. Central holds on to second place in the MVC. First place is on Alaska. And guess what, Scott? On Alaska at Central for the final game of the season. Back.